Well, let's now take a look at the updates from the world of technology. Scientists from the University of Wisconsin, Madison, claim to have a 3D printed, a functional human brain tissue for the first time. The 3D printed brain tissue behaves like natural tissue. It is considered a major leap towards the development of advanced solutions to neurological and neurodevelopmental disorders. Researchers hope this could open the doors for the development of treatments for Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease. On the other hand, United States has announced a new policy that will impose visa restrictions on foreign individuals involved in the misuse of commercial spyware. The policy will apply to people involved in the abuse of commercial spyware to target human rights activists, journalists, opposition politicians, members of marginalized communities or targeted family members. Now, the visa restrictions could also apply to people who facilitate or get financial benefits from the misuse of commercial spyware. The spate of layoffs continues. The latest company to announce layoffs is Snap, the parent company of the popular social media platform Snapchat. Tech companies are by far the worst affected by the layoff tsunami. Snap has announced that they will be laying off around 528, I beg your pardon, 528 employees. That is around 10% of its global workforce. This is not the first round of layoffs taking place at Snap. Last year, Snap axed around 3% of its workforce. And in 2022, the company laid off 20% of its employees. So far, around 32,000 tech workers have lost their jobs in 2024. According to layoffs.fyi, a startup that has been tracking job cuts in the industry since the pandemic.